hello everyone it's me asmr welcoming you to my new photoshop tutorials and today i'll provide you this type of design which is the creative design and i'll show you how to make it out and i'll provide you the psg file as well in my video description and the other accessories file like a uh, font and uh, shapes like uh, the brushes all the stuff so stay at home and do work with the photoshop and uh, do work with my channel let's start the tutorial if you are new in my channel please do subscribe and hit the bell icon for the new notifications at first i'm going to the file and take a new options from here i'll take a artboard which is uh, 3000 by 3000 and hit the create button and after that you are getting the square shape after getting that go to the place embedded options i downloaded a photo from the pixels.com and i'll provide you that photo in my video description as well so insert that photo and insert and fit with the artboard and hit the tick button so after that you are getting this type of effects right press and restyle as the layer and then right press and convert to smart object after that here i write it down something the locked down this type of things and i'll provide you that font in my video description as well go to the text tool or press t from the keyboard and horizontal type tool and write down something choose the font from here so this font and i'll provide you that font download link make the color which is the white type color okay that's good and write down like this locked down and after that press ctrl or command t press the shift button and hold it and rotate this one and place over here and if you have doubt to align these things press ctrl or command a and align it in the middle okay after that i'll change the color i'll pick the color from the skin so this type of color but i'll take this type of color from here okay nice and after that here i just write down something over here so i'll write it down and then go to the shape options you'll get the shape like that i'll provide you the shape download link in my video description as well draw a shape a little bit smaller and double click over here pick the color from the same color and hit the tick button after that again text tool and now i'll take the vertical type tool and write down over here and take the simple font like Arial or like that so i'm taking here uh, like uh, Arial simple Arial and make the font size smaller like this and write down something i'm writing something and making it all caps writing don't go outside okay just written don't go outside outside and again controller command j you can take another things and giving listen to me okay that means i'm just taking these things align like that yeah that's good and after that i'll take the creative shapes like that and other stuffs or brushes so here is the brush options and uh, take a new layer like this and go to the settings import the brushes i downloaded the brushes and so i'll provide you the brush download link in my video description and open it up from here i'll go to the brush tip i'll show the brush which i want to use so this brush this brush and this brush and after that i'll change the color from here and hit ok and i'm making it smaller little bit smaller and just click once and opacity you can make the opacity 100% and flow 100% and press once again yeah that's good you can down the opacity a little bit yeah that's good and after that take another blank layer and again go to the brush b press b from the keyboard and take the shapes change the size of the brush by pressing third bracket opening and closing and just select once that's good and you can just select over here and making it more smaller like this yeah that's good and here as well 
that's good and now i'll take another things like uh, the pluses and the circles and other stuff so taking another blank layer and go to the brush again and here is circle and making the circle size like 40 50 that's good if you want to change the shape of the brush by pressing third bracket opening and closing that's good and you can change the color i'm making it white a little bit here and like this that's good here is a cross sign but i'll make it plus sign like that and change the size like this and change the shape by pressing third bracket opening and closing so here the options to make these things more creative that's good and making it smaller or you can make it like that smaller or bigger you can use like this so you can change the color i'm changing the color from here and taking giving something like new like this things here and now i'll add another uh, like effects or filters from here i'm select all the things like this making it group and making it another copy or a screenshot like this and, and now go to the filter nick collection and color effects pro 4 from the color effects pro 4 you can use any kind of filters from here so get the download link of the color effects pro 4 i'm using here cross processing and from here you can use one of them which one is perfect for your photographs i don't know i think t04 or lt03 or b03 which one is perfect for your photo i don't know just select it and hit the ok button it will take time to load it up and give you the final output to get so you are getting these type of things so hope that you learned a lot from this video if you did please thumbs up and share with your friend and if you have any kind of question query request please do comment on my video comment section and if you want to get the download link of the stocks please check out my video description stay at home and don't go outside until the next video i am a7 signing out today bye bye